Hey everyone! So today we're going to do an 8x16 flip and drag. This color I have down is made by Master's Touch. It's called Fine Touch Ocean Green. So we're going to use that for our base paint today. Just to mix it up a little bit. So I'm going to take a 5 ounce cup and I will spray it with my WD-40 silicone spray. That is just to release the paint from the cup and not to create any additional cells. All our paints in the bottles already have silicone in them. Um, if you're new to our channel, our paint mixing videos are below every video so that you can click on there and learn how we mix our paint. Um, we do the base coat and also our paint pouring. So I am going to use Folk Art Sequin Black today. Uh, this does pull off a gold hue. And then I'm going to put the Lucas Silver Bronze next to that. And then the Soho Phalo Green, just to give us a little bit of color contrast. I will um, mix those just a little bit. And I'm going to flip it. And I did put some extra paint in my cup this time because I do want more color. I don't want just the simple flip and drag that we normally do. Um, because the black um, will probably eat up some of the color. So I already made a, um, adjustments for that. So I'm going to go ahead and poke a hole. And I'm going to just glide my cup on top of that base paint as best I can without hitting the canvas. Now, when you go, when you're done with your first swipe and you see that you want to bring some color somewhere else, I like to dab the color off the edge of my cup and get some of that blue back on there so you don't have a ring when you go in. But I do want to grab just a little bit of this and bring it here. There. So let me give that a quick torch. And I'm going to start tilting it just to get all the paint together. And I'll probably take a little bit of that off of there. But I like just to move it around and stretch it out um, to give it, to open up the cells. And it also helps me when I go back to airbrush to um, know where what edges to grab. So like right here, I'm still a little shallow. And I don't want to pick up any color and put it in there because it will stick out really bad. So I'm going to just put some more of this ocean blue in here. But when I airbrush, I'll push that color over it. Because I did have some really pretty runoff here. But I do want to cover that up because I want to save that for a skin. <laughs> All right, let me torch it again. And we're going to airbrush the edges out. I do want to bring that silver bronze out. It's really pretty. So there, I covered up that spot. Now, if you're new to my channel, um, also, we do use airbrushes on our flip and drags and on some of our other paintings. These are set at 25 PSI so that um, we're not blowing the paint all over the canvas. But it does give you that pretty wispy edge um, that make your paintings unique. So now I'm going to work on the other side. I like to push out instead of pull back. When you pull back, sometimes you have a tendency to go off the canvas. So 
This is a little more controlled this way. And we do hold our airbrush like a pencil. It's kind of interesting there. I had to bring some of that in there. And then um, also when you're doing this, if you see spots that you like that you don't want to push out, you don't have to. Um, I do have one spot here that really needs some paint. But I'm going to go ahead and move that with the airbrush just to fill that in so it doesn't look like I put it there. <laughs> And then I like to step back and just look at it and see if I need to push anything else out. I think I like it right where it's at. Maybe right here. Just to give it a little whimsy there. Alright, I'm going to leave it right there. I'm going to touch up my little corners here because I did lose some paint there but subscribe if you haven't already click on that bell for notifications click like and share leave a comment join us on Facebook um, we have our group the Parage Posse I also have my art page on Facebook Christina Welch art it's really pretty Shop with us on Amazon for all your paint pouring supplies. And on Etsy we have jewelry and I will be putting some more new paintings up there. Um, let's see. Hopefully by the end of next week. <laughs> I'm waiting on weather. It's so hard to take pictures outside. <laughs> okay, and also um, our fan mail box is below our post office box. If you want to sponsor the channel, that link for PayPal is there as well. Um, all that money is used for supplies, and that's all we use it for, supplies. And also, um, check out Teespring if you want to get a Paraj Posse t-shirt or a tank top. They're all there. So I think that's about it. Um, check out all the links. Make sure I might have missed a few. <laughs> have yourselves a great day, and I will see you all in the next one. Bye now.